Cambodia's new government is setting its sight on boosting foreign investments with a series of governance reforms and ways to tackle corruption. The move is part of Prime Minister Hun Manet's plans, which include appointing an anti-grav advocate as minister to take on that task. Prem Kaul who was working with anti-corruption NGO Transparency International for nearly a decade, was speaking at a business event in Singapore. In July, two Singapore finance firms signed a deal with a Cambodian investment company, promising to help list 500 small businesses with a combined market capitalization of 100 billion US dollars in the next 10 years. But to boost investors' confidence, Mr. Call says change must come from the very top, such as tackling corruption. Now, based on a latest corruption index by Transparency International, Cambodia is ranked second lowest in Southeast Asia, right after Myanmar. And it ranked 150 out of 180 countries and territories worldwide. Mr. Call says Cambodia's new government is looking at immediate necessary reforms, such as untangling red tape and simplifying business application processes to reduce the level of corruption. Specifically governance reform to ensure transparency, accountability and that includes the process of business registration, the tax compliant payment, all the procedure related to investment. Some of them will go online or using digital means to make it more simple more convenience and faster. Some of the things now, you can even do it online. So we are going toward e-government uh, and of course we need time to build the platform, but the mindset and the, you know, the direction is there.